uh, tonight I called uh, Senator Cruz and congratulated him on his victory. And, okay. you know, it shouldn't be remarkable uh, to have to admit defeat. But in today's politics, it's becoming rarer and rarer. You know, I was inspired to run partly because of what I saw on January 6th. What happened when people lie about a free and fair election because they weren't happy with the results. I said then, and I'll say it now, you can't just be a patriot when your side wins. So tonight, we didn't win, but we will continue to be patriots. Isn't that right? There's a, a quote from Churchill that's been kicking around in my head that I'll probably mess up. But it said that courage is rightly esteemed as the first of human qualities. Because as has been said, it's the quality that guarantees all others. You have to have courage. It took courage, and I'm not tooting my own horn here, but it took courage for me to come from a single parent household without a lot of money to the United States Congress. It took courage for these, let's, thank you. It took courage for these Texas women to come forward and talk about the most difficult moment of their lives in front of thousands of people. It took courage for each and every one of you and everyone who got involved in this campaign, to, even though we haven't won here in Texas in some time, to believe in this election and to put everything you had into it. And it's going to take courage for whatever comes tomorrow and the day after. This country is worth fighting for. Understand that. This state is worth fighting for. We are a great country. Nobody needs to make us great again. 